Okie dokie. So we are playing Warnings and Waverly Academy. Here's our case file. Here's what we're, the mystery we're going to be solving. The headmistress at the Waverly Academy for Girls has asked me, begged me actually, to discover who's been leaving mysterious notes for students there and causing the strange accidents that always follow them. So malicious was the last accident, the parents of its victim are threatening to sue the school if the perpetrator isn't identified. Fast. Dun, dun, and so, dun. pretending to be a transfer student named Becca Sawyer, I'm going to go undercover at the upstate New York boarding school and hopefully find the culprit. I have to use a fake name instead of my real one because if any of my soon-to-be classmates plug the name Nancy Drew into an online search engine, my cover would be blown in an instant. And to make sure no one sees or hears anything that could give me away, the headmistress has forbidden me to contact her, which means I'm about to be tossed totally on my own into a world of bright, privileged, click-conscious teenage girls. This could be my scariest case yet. Teenage girls, the horror. <laughs> into generic online search engine here. That was what I was giggling about too. Yeah, okay, so Definitely senior detective, junior. obviously, no. right? <laughs> Junior detective, a hundred percent. Here we are. Ooh, those graphics though. All these graphics. Let me out. <gasps> hey, this isn't funny. Let me out. Let me out. And that's the last anybody has seen of her. the new person uh becca something becca sawyer i'm kareen the person who stuck rooming with you i mean you're the person who stuck rooming with me anyway welcome to my your uh, our humble dwelling space oh what a oh. gem okie dokie um which one are we gonna be polite or are we just gonna be nosy be polite yeah be polite thanks sorry oh, to barge in and bug not, you like this okay. you look oh. really busy. <laughs> busy that's the understatement of the year I need her schedule. Four days to finish a 30 page research paper that has to be fully annotated, utilizing a bibliography that has to include at least six published, no online stuff, published sources. Any normal student would hate having you barge in like this. <laughs> but then I'm not all that normal, so you can bug me all you want. Not that you're bugging me. Well, you are technically, but you're not really because I'm so. Never mind. Wow, I hate her. <laughs> I think she's just so awkward. She's not used to talking to people. So she keeps saying the wrong thing first and being like, shit, no, be my friend. I was told you could help me, you know, get oriented. Oh yeah, you bet. Let's see. First thing you gotta do is read the Waverly Student Guide, which is online. If you don't have a laptop, it doesn't look like you do. That one little bag is all you brought? Uh, Us. all my stuff's being shipped from France, Lyon. It'll be here in a couple of days, but please go on. Anyway, you can get online by jumping on the computer in the library. Just make sure you read the part in the guide about Waverly's demerit system really well. It's enforced by Paige. Believe me, you do not want to mess with her. Let's see, what else? Oh yeah, this floor is special because only seniors who are viable candidates for valedictorian live up here. Whoever's named valedictorian gets a full ride scholarship to the university of her choice, so it's a pretty big deal. Of course, the only truly viable candidate is me. Oh, and I should probably tell you about the curse. The curse? Some of the kids on this floor have been getting these like threatening notes from someone calling herself the black cat. Well, the first note's a warning, but if you get a second one, something really bad happens to you. And last week, the girl in the room next door, Megan Vargas, she got a second note, and that night she ate something at dinner she was allergic to and had such a bad reaction that she had to go home. Somebody's obviously playing a prank, but a lot of kids are starting to get really freaked out. <laughs> Wait a minute. You mean the only girls to get notes from this black cat person are girls who are in the running to be valedictorian? I hadn't really thought of it that way, but yeah, I guess that's right. Maybe somebody's jealous of us smart kids or something, or maybe it's one of us. Maybe someone's trying to scare off her competition. Whatever. Mm -hmm. It's not going to work on me. She's something else. Uh, no, that's what I want to know. Yeah, that's, that's probably the, the most option important. I like. I don't think hey, are the challenge is. Have you gotten one of these Sorry, uh, my notes? headphones just yeah, stopped working. Oh, uh-oh. Can you hear us now? Yeah, I got you guys. Can't get the game. I'll just uh, keep messing with it. Okay. Okay. Okay, so she got one three days ago. I wonder why. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's see it. Uh, may I see it? No kidding. May I see it? Sorry. I took one look at it and tore it up. 
But if you'd like to see the note my ex-roommate got, that one's right here. She had kind of a bad experience. Got locked in a pitch black closet overnight. See, she was claustrophobic, so when they found her the next morning, she could barely talk. And when I came back from class that afternoon, she just left. No note, no call, no text, nothing. Just gone. When she got this, how did she react? She tried to laugh it off, but I think she was scared. She was pretty neurotic. What about the second note? There wasn't a second note. Or at least, if there was, she never said anything about it to me. So my question, because I'm already theorizing, is why does she have the other person's note, but not her own? Yeah, it's real easy to say you got a note and then be like, oh, I tore it to shreds and threw it away. That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm sorry, if people were to... literally close to death, I would keep that note and be like, see, I was also threatened with death. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. She's like... That's a good point. That's, that's a very also, good point. But, but also, if she's making them, she could have easily just made herself one. Yeah. And just kept it on her. Yeah. All right, where's the cello music coming from? Okay. We got a lot of people to meet. Where's that cello music coming from? Next door. That's Mel Corbelis. I'm interested in this one. What do you guys say? Yeah, I'm more interested in that question. Okay. Music Has people never fucking stop. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Her roommate did, though. She's the one who got so sick she had to go home. Okay, well, guess we better well, meet. Well, guess I'd better go start meeting people. Yeah, I guess you'd better. I'm not so bad, right? What do you mean? <sighs> it's just that... Well, you're about to find out that I'm not exactly the most... <sighs> Never mind. You'll see soon enough. I think I have a good idea of what she was going to say. Uh... <laughs> uh, is there any way I can get game audio back again? <laughs> you can't hear the cello music? No, I can't hear anything. Uh-oh. I don't know. I guess I'll just read. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, Lexi. I'll Let's... do the voices for you. Now I'll just so offer to do you, all <laughs> Someone named Rachel wants me to come to her room. Haven't Rachel done Hubbard. That. <laughs> She's in the room at the end of the hall. Hello, Becca. Welcome to Waverly. Since you just transferred here and don't really have any papers due or exams to study for, unlike the rest of us, I could really use your help on this project I'm working on. Please come see me as soon as you can. My room's at the other end of the hall. Thank you so much, Rachel. I hate her more. I just I, I just love I that also people hate are her automatically more. like trying to get us into shit. Yeah. I sincerely, well, the other thing is, uh, wouldn't you be behind good. then? Wouldn't you have a lot of work to catch up on? Yeah. Nancy has to do everything all the time. Everybody needs to pick up the slack. True. Nancy <laughs> carries every team. They're like, can you do my math project? And she's like, fuck, I gotta solve a mystery and do your math Very exactly. true. And do all those sandwiches? And yeah. she keeps saying yes because she wants to get on everybody's good side. The hell with that. <laughs> Let's oh see. my gosh, look at that. Look at that drawing. <laughs> so okay, left or right? Big decisions. Right. Okay. Whoa, Whoa shit. shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, your hair's on <laughs> fire. Scare. No wonder you're in a hurry. My hair's on fire? Just kidding. Red hair looks really good on some people. I'm Izzy Romero. That was bitchy. <laughs> I'm Becca Sawyer. I just <laughs> transferred so here. Mean. Where are you from? From also, the we're supposed to believe that but she's I came here a by teenager. Way of France. It's yeah, I know. Story. She looks 40. She <laughs> with a law. <laughs> Let me have your cell phone. My cell phone? Yeah, so I can set you up on the local network. It'll just take a second. Listen. Okay. Get your grubby hands this off way, my cell phone. This way you'll be able phone. to get texted and keep <laughs> up on all the in a Wi-Fi passcode, ma'am, if you tell it to me. Thank you. <laughs> there you go. Look, my room's on the other side of the study hall, but lately I've been spending most of my time in the library. So come talk to me. I'm student body president, which means when it comes to the lay of the land, I got the best map. See ya. Why does she look like a 40-year-old hairdresser? Like She does. <laughs> Why does she have six ears? <laughs> she because... has three hoops on each ear. That That's... was so intense. You know what they say about the hoops? <laughs> the bigger the hoop? <laughs> The kinder the person. I don't know. <laughs> right, right, right. What I would like to know is why, like, every single one of these very smart people is incredibly horrible to talk to. Like, every single yes. one. They're so mean. I know. I'm flashbacks. <laughs> oh my god, anyway. Someone didn't lock their door. It's open. <laughs> that was the Whoa. creepiest way to say that. Like, oh, somebody didn't. Whoa! Hell wow. yeah, party time. We love her. Dude. This is like the one person I think I'm going to be able to stand. Maybe. I don't know. That might be optimistic. Freaking bath. I love Halloween. Uh, I'm mm -hmm. Becca Sawyer. Um, 
Are we going to introduce ourselves or just go straight into... So, how long have you been playing that cello? Why is our name Becca Sawyer? Are we mm. undercover? Yeah, you missed yeah. the beginning. What's up with those I think... tails? Cutting off on that hard right angle. <laughs> yeah, they are. <laughs> it takes a lot of effort to get them to look that way. Um, how much hairspray? Uh, I think... I think it just moved into the room next door. Yeah. I just moved into the room next door. I mean, oh, the yeah, you the transfer. The one who got kicked out of some school in France? <laughs> what? Ooh, what's the rumor? <laughs> oh, 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 do we want to accept this rumor? Or do we yeah, want so to... Yeah, so how did you know? Let's yeah. do it. <laughs> Let's be also cool and bitchy. <laughs> how did you know? <laughs> the primary source of all wisdom and truth around here has been all a buzz. Oh, I think we should go into the black cat. Let's get some yeah. information. You want to just jump right into it? Okay. Yes. What's the rumor mill been saying about the black cat? The black cat is just someone playing an idiotic prank. End of story. Of course, it's not the end of the story for my roommate, Megan, who wound up having to go home sick with an allergic reaction that almost killed her. But it's still a stupid prank. Do we act like we care or... <laughs> Well, we know what happened already, so let's see if they have if she has any idea who left the notes. Okay. Did Megan have any idea who left her those notes? Look, enough about the black cat. The other girls can buy into that garbage all they want, but the pea brain that's behind this, I refuse to give her the satisfaction. So if you have questions for Megan, I think you should call her yourself. 845-555-1849. It's a great thing I just have a steel trap of a memory. Mm-hmm. I'll totally remember that number. Should I write it down? No, it's no, okay. It, It'll go it's in our notes, notes yeah. <laughs> Do I need to be actually writing this down? <laughs> no, it, it it automatically goes into the phone. Let's get the hot goss on courage. Yeah. Like we, need, a, we, we need to know what's up with our friend. <laughs> friend is a very strong word, Gabby, but okay. Yeah, How well you know the girl Everyone's a new with. friend. Kareem. Until proven otherwise. <laughs> Probably better than anybody. She doesn't have a lot of friends, but she's incredibly smart. Plus, she's a social outcast, too. So we get along pretty well. Should we sow the seeds of no, competition? They're friends. <laughs> they're friends. Say she's a it's... social outcast. What makes you say she's a social outcast? I love that Nancy gets she's to go so in there with the most. She's so desperate people to like her. She gets on everyone's nerves. Me? I don't much care if people like me or not. But Corrine? She cares a lot. And it shows. Vibes. That's depressing. Really content. Yeah. <laughs> Should we compliment her cello playing? Yeah. Yeah. Like you play that cello pretty nice. well. Thank you. I taught myself to play when I was 10. Damn. That's impressive. I taught myself how to do absolutely nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Orchestra or instruments? What do we care about more? Yeah, it doesn't matter. Let's learn do more about her. We don't instruments? care about Waverly. Yeah, that's keyboard, true. As in synthesizer, not computer. Although I'm pretty good with computers, too. That might be important. See? That's a clue. About what? I don't know, but it's a clue. helpful hint. <laughs> I'd better get going. When we have computer Those problems. <laughs> okay, dokie. Can we go this way? Oh, we can. Read much followed by more. Wonder why it was spelled with two O's instead of one. Is this sampler as old as it looks? It's old, that's for sure. My great, great, great grandmother made it. She was in the first class of students to graduate from here. Everybody in my family who attends Waverly has to hang that thing in her room. It's tradition. Did your mother graduate from here? And her mother and her mother's mother ad infinitum. I come from a long line of Waverly grads. I'm what you call a legacy. I was admitted automatically. So do you think some of the other people don't like her? Like, is there resentment because she got in automatically? Probably. Yeah, there might be. Um, I'm noticing, like, the capitalization is weird in yeah. addition to... Searching for something is what life is for. To find what is hidden, read much, followed by more. I mean, M-O-O-R-E, that's probably a last name. And read, yeah. read, so it's probably like an author's name. Read much is probably an author's name, followed by more or something like that. I it's bet we have to a... find two authors with the last name much and more. Yeah, something in yeah. the library, probably. Okay, True. somebody else take over now. I have officially gotten us into the game. Rock, paper, scissors. Gabby, you want me oh, to go shit. or you want to go? You can go ahead, Lexi. We just got a phone buzzy buzzy. I don't know oh. what just happened. I'm being gossiped about already? That sure didn't take long. Jeez. Oh, Becca Sawyer has landed. Oh, this is the one who wanted us to do our in. homework. Right? Oh, no. Should we just leave? <laughs> You've led <laughs> us to just bounce. Into the lion's den. Oh, she looks like the kind of girl who would have us do her homework You for. must be Becca Sawyer. Did you see uh -huh. my I did if you're Rachel Hubbard. That's me. 
And boy, am I glad you're here. See, I've got this web design project that's due by the end of the break. Only I've got two papers to write by then, too. So, since you're a transfer and you won't really have anything to do until classes start, I was hoping you could help me. But break. I don't even know you. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna say, like, I don't even know you. Like, who cares about web design? Just, I don't know you. <laughs> I don't owe you a goddamn thing, lady. <laughs> no. Nancy went to therapy. She Set did. Those boundaries, girl. <laughs> she <laughs> is. But I don't there even you know. know you. There's really not that much to know. <laughs> I'm Rachel depressing. Howard. I'm from Pittsburgh. I'm here on a scholarship. I blew a recent AP chem test, which means I probably won't be valedictorian unless everybody else totally messes up. I love dogs, I hate cauliflower, my favorite subject's math, and I am desperate. Look, I Ew. just need you to do the front work. Take <laughs> pictures and upload them mostly. The pages I'm designing will be part of the Waverly School website. The way she said, look, I just hated it. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> she um, is okay the most desperate of anyone to become valedictorian because she's at a disadvantage and she's there on scholarship, which means she's not of the same social class allegedly as the rest of the girls. True. Well, you're really unpacking some trauma here in Nancy. <laughs> <laughs> we all went to therapy we're and now we're here to it's my first unpack day. I barely therapy. know my way around. Now we're ready to spread it to everybody else. Just oriented just and meet people. With the socioeconomic I mean, you inequalities. Just <laughs> Well, I guess I could help you. Sure. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, what you need to do first is take a picture of all the valedictorian candidates. Here are their names. You have a camera cell phone, right? Of course. Great. This it's so weird. After you've taken everybody's <laughs> it was picture, right. It is grunt work. We literally have to go take and pictures of people. According to the instructions on that sheet, I'll check the pictures. You didn't get up. composites if taken. I you're at a private take school. Any of them over, I'll leave a note oh, true. You know they all have headshots. Done, report back to me. You right? get headshots like I the first week. I may need you to do something else. In the meantime, I, I have to do something else. My advisor. So if you could get started, that would be great. I really appreciate this, Becca. See you later, okay? It'd be super helpful because I've been so busy with school. If you could do my laundry for me, <laughs> um, it would really just like ease my burden. Wash my underwear, please, and thank you. <laughs> Can we get in? Locked. Izzy must be somewhere else. I love that Nancy just tries doors. The way that she did it too, like it wasn't just like gently turning Violet. the knob. <laughs> it was like, oh, let me the fuck in. Let me potentially break Go this away. doorknob in order to get in. Ooh, I like Paige so the Paige most because she's not pretending sorry, to be nice. I don't want to be disturbed <laughs> right now. Everybody else is fake there. as fuck. Do not leave personal belongings. Dispose of waste. Electronics are basically don't off. be a dick in the rec room. We yeah. can't use our cell phone. Oh, that'll get us demerits. So think about that. Oh, I bet it will. I'll have to keep that in mind. Yeah. Good. Yeah. We gotta go stand in the hallway to text. <laughs> <laughs> Sporty athletic girl. You must be the girl who came all the way from France with just the clothes on her back. Becca something. Becca Sawyer. I'm Leela Yadav. Welcome to Waverly. Her eyes are scary. <laughs> she Yeah, she's a little bit terrifying. Should we, which one? Should we ask why she's I like her voice though? Yeah, I do like her voice. What happened to your wrist? I'm curious, what happened to your wrist? What happened to your wrist? I took a really freak fall and sprained it. I'm supposed to rest it for at least a week. That's why I'm in here instead of the gym shooting baskets. Playing oh, the so she's like a tri-sport athlete proms. Uh-huh. I think I'm just saying that, but it's true. In fact, let's play air oh, hockey. No. Come on, <laughs> by helping me stay in shape, you'll be helping out your new school. You want to get off on the right foot here, don't How you? How does air hockey yeah, help a new station? I, I don't have time right now. I told Rachel Hubbard I'd help her with her web project. That's too bad. Honestly, Let's see what she thinks. I think the that. first one. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was kind of going to... I was leaning that way, too. Cause... We've been really jumping the black cat thing with people. I think we need to, like, get their social deets first. <laughs> get the hot goss, because mm -hmm. that's what's going to help too us. Too bad I can't play, or too bad I'm helping Rachel? Both. But mostly too bad you're being subjected to Rachel on your very first day. Well, I don't <laughs> like Rachel, so... so. No, I, so we're not we just going to say... Why do you say yeah. that? Why do you She's say got that? This you you got to let other people people. express themselves. She'll say something one day, then deny it the next. Or she'll do something, then claim she didn't. She's actually kind of scary. You'll see. In fact, it wouldn't surprise me if she's the black cat. You heard about the black cat, right? Oh yeah, I heard. See, Rachel flunked a test a couple weeks ago, which means she can't be valedictorian. So maybe, in some twisted way, she thinks we're to blame and she's using this black cat stuff to freak us all out. Not that it's working. On me, at least. I've won state championships in both soccer and basketball. 
No way am I going to let a couple of stupid notes get to me. Okay, then. All right, Gabby, do you want to take over? Because my mouse is lagging real hard. Um, the picture, do you ever hang out with my roommate? I say we, get, we keep getting hot goss, and then we can take the picture after. Okay. Where is my mouse keep going? Do you ever going? hang out Hello? with my roommate, Kareen? Not if I can help it. I mean, we, we want to know who hangs out yeah. with her or why not. I, th I say who because we know why not. That's true. <laughs> who does hang out with her? Mel Corbelis and her are friends. My mouth no <laughs> big surprise. After all, weirdos of a feather flock together. Because you're in the running for valedictorian, oh. I need to get a close-up of you for the school website, if that's okay. No problem. Fire when ready. Oh my gosh, my mouse keeps jumping windows. Do you want me to take over just for this? Yes, please. <laughs> so she doesn't yell at us. There we go. Save. Yes. Is there a problem? No, shut up. Actually, let's take a couple. We can take a few, right? And then we won't have to Is ask them again. Is there a problem? I bugged you enough for now. That's all right. I'm kind of waiting for my boyfriend to call. Ooh, he goes to Oxborough. Boyfriend. That's the boys' school just down the road. Talking to you helped kill the time. I'll see ya. Okay, bye. Okay, so she got a boyfriend at the school down the road. I like how, and I don't know if this is at all true to real life because I don't know any gendered boarding schools in real life, but in fictional universes, it's always like, you know, the other one in town where all the boys go. Or like, yeah. They're like a, a one city away. Um, let's mm -hmm. see. Uh, there's a snack bar. Uh, yes, let's give high schoolers coffee in larger <laughs> Oh, that's the closet that the girl got locked in, I bet. Yeah. Here oh, we supply are. Closet. Oh, I, can we turn on the light or anything? Yes. Oh, so that's how they <laughs> locked her in. There's a key. Nice. Her usual, just stealing <laughs> keys. Yeah, literally, like, we don't know what it's to, and we don't know who might need it, who accidentally left it in there. We're just like, <laughs> mine now, yoink. No. Oh, is it locked? It's locked. Um, that nope. did not help. Ooh. Oh, that's gonna be a clue. Play, you you play piano. You, we're we're relying on you for this. <laughs> oh, smart. <laughs> I just so remembered smart. That. I just remembered that was an option. Cool. <laughs> um. Yeah, hide that. Hide that from anybody else. <laughs> yeah. We don't need anybody else figuring it out. Can we go outside? I think so. Um... Oh, the squirrel? Yeah. Squirrel. An albino squirrel. Right squirrel. You guys both said that at the same time. Oh, can we click Layton, bottom right corner? Can we click on that? Like, it looks like there's a, Ooh. yes. Somebody read that. Waverly Academy for young girls. Uh... Yeah, so who's gonna read the, <laughs> okay, the so Greek that... letters? Uh, numbers, not uh, letters. They're um... Roman. Um, oh my god! <laughs> Wait, yeah, get over here, Mallory. A fuck ton of I years ago. How many years ago? A fuck ton. Alright, good luck at this one. Come take a look. There's Does a lot. Does she know what they mean? She's a history teacher. There's Dif no, that can't be 1500. This is in the US, right? Yes. D. <laughs> it's like, it's oh, gotta be 1800? Like 1800. The chat's got 1866. Nice right. job, everybody. Thank Good you. team effort. Ooh, teamwork. Beat you to it. Teamwork. All I got was 16. <laughs> that Locked. was not correct. I forgot the L. Locked? Ugh. Nope. That'll be fun to explore later, though. Yeah. When we get a real key. Or when we come up from the basement. Well, we won't be able to come up from the basement because it's, it's like locked. a we'll padlock. We'll just bust it. <laughs> <laughs> Nancy just karate kicks it. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh, Looks like somewhere. I need a key. I have a key. Is it this key? Is it this key? Oh, nice. <gasps> it's this nice. key. Nice. Okay, so checked out to El Yadav. Oh, so Lydia, Lila, whatever her name is. Yeah. The soccer oh, I bet it's going to be like, yeah, which ones you use in what order of the meal or something like that. Yeah, and probably the book that tells us about this was sitting right here. Oh, but now it's. Yeah, celebra celebratory dinner something card so yeah so that lady yeah. that lady, that girl has it a oh. library. beautiful library though i love those little stained glass lamps i know they look like the new york public library yeah Ooh. imagine just like that's not the thing with the gray squirrels i'm assuming we're on the east coast oh i bet so also nice boarding school room. just give me a very east coast vibe let's see especially when they're old as hell new arrivals those don't look very new when were they new back when 
the school was founded, 1866. Let's see. Oh, well. Not oh, like I a real it. adult, just the student body president. That's yeah. um, that's the girl that's in the library, though. Izzy. The one that looks really, really weird. Listen, please. <laughs> Hush, it was worth a shot. Bonjour. Pictures. Unfortunately, oh, that and Chouette Laura are all the French I know. Hey, my condolences <laughs> on your roommate assignment. You know, it might not be too late to get it changed. Everybody hates Corinne. I know, what the hell? I mean, I didn't like her, but now I'm starting to feel a little bit of, you know, that roommate. So we know that she wasn't mean. She was just awkward. She was horribly <laughs> awkward. Look, this, this girl was mean to our face. She's like, yes, some people can pull off red hair. Not you was the <laughs> not you obviously, but like <laughs> some people can. Ask um, her that she doesn't like Corinne because we know that she lives with that Leela girl. Yeah, you don't like Corinne either. <laughs> Nobody likes oh, no. Corinne. Why not? Because she's Corinne. There's and so Corinne is to just her. not cool. But look, don't worry. Everyone knows rooming with Corinne wasn't your idea. As long as you don't hang out with her, nobody's gonna hold it against you. Well, now I want to hang out us? with her. Now I want to hang out with her. You know what? You can't tell me what not to do. I think <laughs> it's more important to know if she likes a roommate, right? Well, important, but I, I like the question better. Yeah. Do you like your roommate? My roommate's Lila Yadev, athletic superstar and savior of Waverly's athletic program. We actually get along fine. Probably because we're pretty much equals. Everyone knows who she is, and everyone knows who I am. A word to the wise. Avoid hanging out with your roommate oh as gosh. much as possible. Oh my god. <laughs> we need both of these things, so let's get the password first. Oh, we got a lot of things. Well, ask her about the black cat. She seems like she could be a good black cat. Have you gotten any notes from the black cat? Everyone on the Valcan floor has. The valedictorian candidate floor. Our floor. Okay, I get it. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> has anything like this yeah. happened before? Has anything like this ever happened before? Not as far as I know. Although, supposedly, there was a teacher here once, a long time ago, that none of the students liked. They were always playing tricks on her, scaring her and stuff, until one day one of their pranks gave her a heart attack, and she died. Her black cat went running oh off into the God. woods during the funeral and never came back. But for years after that, people would spot it lurking in the shadows, and whenever they did, something bad it's a little happen. intense they said it was the teacher miss hallowell coming back as her cat to get revenge somebody <laughs> around here is obviously trying to get some mileage out of a silly ghost story one the headmistress is trying desperately to squelch by the way so remember you didn't hear it from me okay we definitely heard it from you got it um <laughs> <laughs> okay so password yeah Apparently, I need to get a password from you before I can use How this I'm trying to make us do a task. That's right. Mm. Unfortunately, no. I need to finish this DNA model before I can give it to you. <laughs> Too bad, huh? I hate her. I can't get I it, love from that. Anyone I can it from anyone else. Anyone else? Nope. Uh, what's your take on What's now? your take on now? <laughs> All that edgy, free spirit, deep thinking stuff is just an act. She knows she can't cut it here, so she's making it look like she doesn't care. Oh, that was, that was a real bold statement. <laughs> you don't think she's that smart? Book smart? Maybe. People smart? Complete zero. If her mother hadn't gone here, they oh wouldn't have allowed goodness. her within 50 miles of this place. In fact, I think she's a borderline psychopath. Takes one to know one, damn. Uh, <laughs> yeah, these people are just like, this person's a psycho. This person's crazy. I know. And this I'm... person's a schizo. I'm like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Ladies, please, in. can we dial it back? This is before the mental health era, guys. <laughs> it really was, but like, boy, does it show. I've got like a barely passed flip phone here. That's true. That's that's true. I feel like, said, I feel do like you have a gonna camera call me gay is an insult. So. <laughs> um, Someone's gonna call my outfit gay. <laughs> Not as a compliment. <laughs> uh, All right, let's, I, let's I do get that the... and then take a look at the DNA homework. Okay. Any idea who the black cat is? It's Mel. See, like I said, she's a little psycho. And Black Again with the psycho. mishaps, it all fits in with that inane goth thing she's got going. I mean, who else could it be? You? Quite literally anybody? <laughs> we have eliminated no suspects. If I help you with your DNA homework, will you give me that computer password? Sure, you bet. Excellent idea. 
Okay, here's what you need to do. You just have to make sure adenine is oh, always no. paired with guanine and cytosine is always paired with guanine. And make sure guanine. each pair is connected to a sugar on the <laughs> alternating sugar phosphate side. Just jump in. You'll figure it out. When you're done, bring it back. And if you get it right, I'll tell you the password. Sounds good. Seems like a real easy thing to do what if you already on? know the answer. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> I need to get I don't going. Look at your no face problem. Anymore. Okay. <laughs> we need the picture. Yeah, we'll get it after we do this. Oh, Jesus. Okay.